Okay, guys. I am here at the Witlacoochee River. And I'm using my phone because I brought this, but... I have an issue. No memory card. So... And I can't get it... I can hook it... It'll pair up with my phone, but it won't put anything into my phone. And the memory card's gone. So... I'm going to have to use my my video or my cell phone so hopefully it'll be all right okay guys so I caught my first one and I forgot my bait let me out here whoops pretty good size it's a nice pan fish there so there's my first one I gotta go get my bait sorry I gotta use my phone guys but so there's number one <coughs> I'll be right back with you okay guys I'm on a trail in the middle of the Whistlecoochee River I'm at a crossroads there's one two three four ways I can go I'm in search of something if I find it, I'll let you know. If not, on my outro, I'll let you know what I was looking for. Uh, I thought this was pretty cool. Hang on. I'll have to Google that and find out who that is. 'bout I'm about three miles in right now so let's go this way for a little bit see what's happening okay guys this is what I came here to see walked all this way had to stop about every hundred feet An old cabin let's go around the front here couple YouTube videos on this there's the river check it out and I don't have a light well I think I got a light on this thing hang on yeah I do and so this was built in the mid 1800s. I'm not sure the exact date. I'll put it on the screen here for you. Some information. Um, guy built this for his family. Awful small. That's still got the screen in it. And this used to be a screen door here. And you still got. The bed here, which like looks like it may have been one of them fold up beds. Let me make sure I'm zoomed out. Yeah. Okay, so there's no water line there. Now I'm not sure when the last time it was resided in. But, supposedly, the gentleman, there's a piece of the roof down there, it's 
supposedly the gentleman that lived here that built the cabin uh, grew oranges, citrus fruits around here. Maybe that's far so many trees, but he grew those. And I think it was, I'll put it across the screen, but in the 1850s, 1859 and 1870-something, 70 72 maybe. The freeze got his crops, so he moved out. Now, there's also rumors, I don't know, there's not much about it, but there's also rumors about this place being used as a moonshine still. But now, you can, you can take a trail, it's pretty well blazed. Right there's the trail, just right beyond them pines, about 50 feet from me. So what monkey and I are thinking I know where this place is now I can find it that's the with Lacucci bringing the boat down here docking tying off right in here we just throw out a mooring line tie off this tree or something we're thinking about now I don't believe the guy died here but there's always memories in a place like this but I haven't seen anybody YouTube yet of camping out in here. And I think that's what we're going to do. Now, I don't know if she will or not. This may be a solo overnighter. Uh, we just have to see. I don't know if she'll, she'll stay in there all night. I can put my bedroll right up on top of that, maybe. And camp out in here and film it for you guys. If I don't forget my damn memory card. So, yeah, that's... Uh, that's pretty cool. Nice, that's a big tree. Jeez. If you cut a hole through there, you could drive a you could drive a riding mower through that easy. I don't know what this is on it. You can hardly see it. Some kind of painting. Almost looks like that one. Oh, it's a heart. Okay. But, beer cans. Jeez, come on, you packed it in. Pack it out, it's much lighter. I mean, that thing ain't gonna give you any grief. So, I'm not sure what time it is, but I'm gonna have to be heading out. But this is, like I said, sorry, I gotta use my cell phone, but this is what it is. This is what I came all this way for. So now I think when we go back at that intersection I just showed you, um, I think when we go back, I'll just hit the trailhead instead of going back to the campgrounds because that it's like I'm a couple miles from the campgrounds and um, then about another mile out from there. So I think if I hit the trailhead trail, which is just back away, because I don't know how far this loop goes or I would just take it back, but I think I'll go back to the trailhead and I'll take it out and it, it brings me. It'll bring me, it should bring me right out at the, uh, at the gate, I believe, I hope, as if it brings me back to the, if it brings me back to the campgrounds, I'm not going to be happy. I am going to be tired, though. So this is pretty cool. I just wanted to show you guys this. So, yeah. One more look. And like I say, this may be a solo thing. This would be cool. I'm not too concerned about the bears. I am, however, concerned about the snakes coming up in here and climbing into bed with me. But it'd be for a rough night's sleep if I got any at all, because I don't sleep hardly anyhow. Okay, guys, so here we go. Okay, one more shot of the inside. I'm going to sit down here and drink a, oh, drink a beer. Yeah. I'm going to sit down here and drink a pop and uh, make my way out of here. So there you guys go. There's this. Uh, I'm not going to end it here. Uh, if I see anything else interesting, see that water line. There must have been a well around here uh, somewhere, which usually means a well house. 
because uh, I would have had to pump it somehow. This is a mound. What is it? A mitter mount? Mitter? M I D D E L. I'll put it on the screen too. It's a shell mound. It's an Indian mound, but it's not an Indian burial ground. And I'll put a link. I'll put a description in the link of what that means, so you guys can uh, go down to the description and check it out. So hopefully this is all right. Um, I mean, like I said, so I got for right now. So. All right, I got to get off here for now, and I'll be back with you guys in just a second. Hang tight. So, I found the skeletal remains of an armadillo. Down in here, I don't know how well my phone camera will pick this up, but right up through there, right there, this alligator trail. This goes right down to the swampy area of the river. Fresh alligator trail. He was going that way. Alright. Onward and outward, right? Check it out, guys. That's pretty cool. Got oranges. Wild orange tree. It's pretty neat, huh? Let's see here. Where'd that one go? Right there. There it is. Pretty cool. Out in the middle of the trail. We're still heading that way. This is an orange trail. I'm thinking it comes out at the campground. If I'd have took the blue trail, it took me out by the gate. But all right, let's keep going. Okay, guys, I'm back at the campsite, campgrounds. Uh, so I still got a mile to go out that way. And I can meet Monkey at the truck. It's after three, so there's the river. So I sat down here where we started, and I'm gonna take a break and uh, make my way to the gate. She's got a hurt toe. Uh, she's going to walk back and go to that cabin with me, but glad she didn't. She would have never made it with that toe. So, I took the long way back, man. I should have came back the way I went down. I would have been all right. But, whatever. <laughs> what a day. Be sore tomorrow. And I was supposed to be walking like this. I go about 100 feet. I need a backpack. That's what I need. That way I'd, I wouldn't have to carry my tackle box and stuff like that. I can just throw a couple hooks and sinkers and whatever in it and, and be gone with it. But yeah, so it's beautiful out. I don't know what the temperature is. It's pushing 80, if not 80. So we we'll have a cold drink. I'm going to head back out to the gate. Hopefully, if I ain't there, maybe she'll walk, start walking back in here before she gets nervous. So, I was thinking maybe I told her 3.30, but I'm, I'm pretty sure I said, well, let's just make it 4, but I can't remember for sure. So, I don't want her worried about me, and I really don't want her, after going to work, walking on her toe. Or, you know, with her foot being as sore as it is. All right, I'll be back with you when I get to the gate. Okay, guys, I made it back at the rendezvous point for Monkey. Uh, can't never tell where my camera is. There it is. All right, man, they should have picnic tables here. Dang. So I made it back. Last time I looked at the time, it was three thirty-three. So I think, pretty sure I told her just meet me here at four o'clock. So, uh, I think she said if she had time, she was gonna stop by the house first and then come down, because I'm not that far from the house. I'm not in walking distance. <laughs> but I got a map 
to see where I was and that map is way off it's it's nowhere near close to what the trails are it's stupid like when we was at the at that intersection there where I could go one of four ways technically five there's only a couple of trails going in and out and the trail I took isn't even on there and it was a blaze trail a bunch of orange marks you know on trees so you can't get lost out here so yeah I'm gonna wait on monkey when monkey gets here I'll uh I'll kick you back on and do my outro, but I'll show you where I was. Where I was thinking I'd come out is right over here. Right there's a little trail. But that's a blue trail. And I think it's new trail. It's like 2.2 miles, so um, but apparently out through there, there's a backcountry campground out there that you got to hike to or ride a horse to. It's like from where we was at on the, um, at that intersection, where we was at there, uh, if we would have went straight, we'll come to that backcountry campground like to hike in there someday but that that'd have to be a couple day thing and backpack and uh may even have to camp out just to get to the campground i don't know but anyway i'll kick you back on when monkey gets here she'll be here shortly so what a hike we got monkey on the scene coming to rescue shea bear again I was sitting here complaining <laughs> they should have picnic tables, but I forgot I've been lugging a chair around with me for five hours. Thanks, monkey. Hey, babe. You tired too? How's your toe? Throbbing. Yeah. Like killing me. Throbbing. Using my phone. How come? What happened? No memory card. You're kidding me. Nope. Why do you keep doing that? I don't know, but here's the thing. I thought it's no big deal because I got 32 gigs of internal memory, right? Yeah. I can't get into it. Oh. So I thought, well, I'll just pair this up uh -huh. and use this, and you can set this to use internal memory. Right. It wouldn't do it. So I got to figure out what's going on with that. Hmm. So, anyway. Yeah, fun. I caught one fish. One fish to my five fish that I caught. Hey, remember last time I went out? But I didn't hear. You should have went to the same spot. Is somebody camping in there? Yeah, but I was at that spot, so. Hmm. Well, maybe it's just a bad day. <laughs> yep. But you just don't have this All right. All right, guys, so. Uh, I guess that's it for today. I was going to have two videos, a fishing video and a camp or a cabin video, but I just rolled them into one since I only caught one fish. I'm sorry. So, monkey dropped me off when she went to work. So, anyway, there you go. Some neat stuff there. Hope you enjoyed it. I appreciate it. Thanks, monkey. You're welcome, babe. Appreciate it. Did you eat all my sausages? Mm, almost. <laughs> I bought some sausages at a gas station. She never... Like, she'll go out and get me cigarettes, and she says, Oh, they, they don't have them, they don't have them, they don't have them. Every time I go in there, they have them. Except the ones that were out. Yeah. So I bought them all today. There was 13 of them, and I gave her one. I left, and I ate two before I got out. Because I didn't really have any way to carry them. So uh, I left them in the truck. She's like, that's dangerous, leaving them in here. It was. I made you eat. Two. <laughs> two. Two plus the one you gave me, so I had three. <laughs> yeah, more than me. They're two for a dollar fifty nine cents so each. Good. So you know, oh, shit. they're so addictive. <laughs> yeah, I mean, what the hell, you know? Oh, uh, they're better than any beef jerky. Yeah. 
Uh, All right, guys, I'm going to get off here. I don't know if I'll get this edited for you tonight or not. So if I don't, you'll be seeing this. What is today, Tuesday? Mm -hmm. You'll be seeing this Wednesday. So thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate it. Shea Brother, Myth Man, Legend. I'm tired. <laughs> Monkey says she's out for now. <laughs> Hi, y'all. Bye, guys. <laughs>